Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Sidetrack here, bringing you episode 4 in my Let's Play series. Um, we're playing Direwolf 20's awesome mod pack, entitled Direwolf 20. Um, so, between last episode and this episode, I went around, I did some mining, I got some obsidian, so we have enough to make our nether portal, um, and I'm currently smelting whatever I have left. Um, so, for the nether portal, Let's go ahead and stick it out here somewhere. Make sure there's no bad guys. Um, I really have no idea where I want it. For right now, let's just do this. We'll cut into the side of a hill. And that way, if we so desire, we can put some doors up and keep the pig man from escaping. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to go minimalist on my design of the um, nether portal. So, you know, you can cut the sides out. So, all you need is a frame. So, um, the real reason I want to go to the nether, um, other than the fact that it's, you know, fun and scary there, um, is I want to get some new ores for use in Tinker's Construct. So, downloading train, hopefully we'll get a good seed, maybe be near something fun. I guess we'll find out. Um, and it's red. Okay, come on game, catch up with yourself. Let's go, chop chop. Okay, there we go. That took a long time. Alright, so, this is looking promising. Oh, is that a strong? It's a stronghold right over there. Very cool. Burning blossom. Not sure what that is. What is flesh? <laughs> oh no, that's just creepy. Hmm. Chunks of flesh. Just what I always wanted. That's really gross. <laughs> uh, glow shroom. Don't know what to do with that. Some of this stuff is new to me, because I, I don't... Ooh, Lime Dial, that's cool. Um, overgrown Netherrack. Some more mushrooms. Um, very cool. So, I guess the first thing to do is to run around and look for things that are of value. Now, I don't know what the... Ow! Okay, that hurts. Is that gonna put it, put it get put out? There it goes. Okay. <laughs> Orange dye. Okay. Well, I don't think that's worth burning for. Um, all right. So what we're looking for? Um, oh, here we go. Cobalt ore. This is from Tinker's Construct. This is really what I want here. Um, but I'll grab the Nether quartz as well. Just get a couple of them for now. I see some pigmen off in the distance. Um, so we'll grab a couple of the nether quartz just so I can show you something else um, that is pretty cool. Oh, another cobalt. So now these ores are fairly rare. You usually have, you know, a handful per chunk. Ooh, an imp. Hello, Mr. Imp. There we go. Ooh, and I can become an imp now. Um, all right, so, oop, fire bat. Those guys are kind of annoying. Where are you? There we go. Um, all right, so, what else can we look for? And here's what I'm actually gonna do, and I, I almost feel like I'm cheating here, but I'm gonna go ahead and use morph, and I'm gonna turn into a bat. I've got plenty of bread, so I can, come on, there we go. Um, because this allows for very easy exploration, and plus you can kill ghasts really easily. Um, what is up over here? It's a tree of some kind that's going right up through Hellbark. Interesting. Um, and you can also squeeze through tight spaces. Is this gonna burn me if I touch it? No, just if I harvest it. I'm gonna go ahead and get this. ones. Um, and I suppose I'll grab soul sand as well. 
Eh, you know what? Let's transport all this. Very cool. Ow! Okay, it does hit you if you touch it. <laughs> I have no idea. Um, Alright, so... Ooh, more cobalt. Alright, so the cobalt I want for my pickaxe of awesomeness. The... Oh, and here's the other one. Ardite. Ardite I want for a new sword. Like I said, we're going to be replacing weapons and things very quickly here. Um, what is that? It's... Is that end step? No, that's got to be a, a hive block. Intriguing. Is there something inside? Do I want to run? <laughs> what do I do with it? Ow! Oh. No, I can use it as fuel. Interesting. Wonder if I use my. Nope, doesn't go any faster that way. I wonder if there's something in here that's gonna eat me. <laughs> Honeycomb. Oh boy, that's probably not a good sign. I'm gonna come back later when I have actually have armor. Well, let's see if I can kill this guy. Gas are ridiculously easy to kill when you can fly. <laughs> oh, I missed him. Okay, fine. I'll just do it this way. Oh god. Watch, gas are ridiculously easy to kill as I die. <laughs> Alright, eat some food here. What on earth? Oh, I think something must have just spawned in. Oh, sweet. A gas tier. Just what I always wanted. Alright. So, um, let's go back over this way and see if we can find some more Ardite and stuff. And, you know, I really should have made myself some armor because I am running around naked right now. Well, relatively naked. And I think this is where my house was. Do, do, do. Let's see if we can find some more Ardite and Cobalt. This flesh is creepy. <laughs> Alright, here's some ash clouds. A bunch of little spiders. We we'll definitely have to check out this stronghold later. See if we can get any blazes and blaze powder. Maybe set up a blaze farm. Ooh, Ardite. Excellent. And get shot in the back here. Whoa, whoa. I don't know what that is. Sunstone. Interesting. Ooh, all right, and cobalt. Ooh, let's see. How do I get this? Let's try this. There we go. Lots of ardite. And whoa, a three pack. Not going to complain about that one. Where's that cobalt? There it is. I don't like being this close to lava. It makes me very uncomfortable. Alright, how much do I have? Four and five. That's a pretty close to about what I need. I'm going to go back and before I'm... Well, here we go. I'll do five and five. Uh, this is going to take forever. It's getting there slowly. Okay. Let's head back before I die and uh, let's make some armor before I come back here again. <laughs> let's be smart here. Something that I'm not very good at doing. Oop, but while I'm here, I should grab this glowstone. I didn't die. 
um, like I said, the uh, the morph is uh, it's very very useful. Let me block this up. No pigment are going to come out. Not that that's a big deal or anything. All right, so let's see. What do we do with this stuff? Well, first thing I had to turn this off. Is finished processing everything. Looks like it. Okay, first up is some cobalt. I'm going to go ahead and melt all the cobalt. Um, and what I want to do is make myself a pickaxe head. Um, this is going to be our final, or at least for a while, pickaxe. Alright. Put that down, and what we're going to do... I can find my book so I can show you as I talk, or talk as we do it. Um, I'm going to make a pickaxe um, that has... Do, 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 do. Um, I think I'm going to do an obsidian binding to get my reinforced level 3. I'm tempted to do paper, but I think I want the reinforced. I'm going to do a... Um, Ardite handle. It's going to give me a hand multiplier of 2.0, so it's going to double the durability of my pickaxe. It's also going to give me stone bound level 2, so it's going to mine faster as it wears out. And then I'm going to have some cobalt on my pickaxe head, which is going to give me a very fast mining speed and some good durability. 800. Alright, so looks like that is melted. Go ahead and pop this in here. Take my pickaxe head. Alright, and we're back. So we've got the manioleum. And we're going to make ourselves a Minialium sword blade. Very cool. And now we just need to get the rest of this cobalt and the Minialium out. So we're going to do it this way. Um, I am going to disable one of these. So now it will only dump into one. And you can see that since I only had one ingot, well, you can't see it anymore. <laughs> I only had one ingot of manielium, and then I've got the rest ingots of cobalt. They will all come out. Now, I might regret turning all these into ingot form, because I might decide that there really is something that I want to do with this cobalt. Um, but for the moment, I think this is what I want to do. All right, so next up, while this is going, I'm going to melt the rest of my ardite. And while that melts, we will take a quick commercial break. Alright, so our ardite is all melted away in there. Go ahead and stick my tool rod cast under here. Grab two tool rods. And this is all I'm going to do for the moment. The rest of this I am going to suction out and turn into ingot form for now. Um, we are definitely going to play more with um, Tinker's Construct, but for right now, this is good. Um, Next up, I need to make myself an obsidian binding, and I suppose I'll make myself a cactus cross guard. Cactus cross guard, you know, I think I had a cactus shard somewhere. Oh well. Almost positive I have an. Oh, I do have an obsidian shard. Alright. See, I can do things right once in a while. Alright, so, let's put this on our part builder, we're going to do our pickaxe first, pickaxe, pickaxe, oop, that's not a pickaxe, and pickaxe, and this is going to get us what I, my favorite pickaxe, now, obviously, there's all kinds of different choices, um, but I like this one, and, alright, so a good name, um, or a bad name, side, bigger. If I could type. Because that makes total sense. Alright, so we replaced nose picker with side picker. Well, meh. <laughs> At least it's got a better name. Um, and the next thing, we're going to make another longsword. And you know, why am I making a stonebound longsword? That would be stupid. Alright, so... Alright, here we have making our new sword. Now, I would probably prefer to use something like a slime handle um, for better durability, 
but I don't really feel like wasting many Ilium on it, because that's got great durability. Um, but this should work quite well. Alright, so we've replaced all this good stuff. New sword. There goes our old pickaxe. Very cool. So I should mention, when you kill, when you, uh, there's a, a mod in here called Billand, and basically it's Legos in Minecraft, as if Minecraft wasn't blocky enough. Um, but you can basically get this order form from monsters as you kill them. It's a chance to drop. And you can place orders for various packs, and you get Legos to play with. Now, I haven't really played much with this. It costs some emerald, but it's kind of an interesting idea. And we'll, you know, definitely have to play with this once we get some emeralds. So, um, I think this is probably a good place to call it for now. Um, we've got ourselves uh, at least what's going to be our pickaxe for right now. Although I do want to add a little bit to it. We've got a decent sword. Whoops, wrong way. So, I'm feeling pretty good. I think this was pretty very productive. When am I going to get luck version 1 on here? Still not yet. No fortune. Um, need to find a lot more lapis. Anyway, hopefully this was interesting to you guys. And next time, we are definitely going to get into um, looking at thermal expansion and actually get some really good machines going. Um, we're going to start playing with some of the stuff that we got from the nether. And hopefully you guys will enjoy. Until next time. Have a great day, folks.